Juggling Laboratories. Welcome to Juggling Laboratories. In this series, we're going to be looking at experiments with clubs, balls, and other props. See how they work, what they can do, and what they can't. This week on Juggling Laboratories, we're going to be looking at something that I call the step-on. That's where you take one club, step on the butt of it, and cause it to flip up onto your foot. But it's not the only thing your butt is good for. A common variation is simply to drop one club onto the other, causing the second club to bounce off the first. But is there anything else? Before we move on, there's a couple things I gotta point out. Now, as I was filming some of these, it was brought to my attention that there's a new DVD featuring one of my favorite jugglers, Wes Peden, and another favorite, Jay Gilligan, who produced some tricks that might be similar to what you're about to see. Now, a few years ago, I showed some of these tricks that I'm working on to Wes Peden at a juggling festival. Who knows? Maybe he created the same tricks before he saw mine. Maybe he's been doing it for years. Maybe they're old tricks. Or maybe he was inspired by something that I showed him to come up with a whole bunch of new variations. I don't know. I haven't seen the DVD. But either way, it doesn't really matter where one idea comes from or where another idea comes from. The idea is these are experiments, and I hope that you play around with them and come up with tricks of your own. Now, if there's any way that we can transfer some of that energy from the step into something other than just getting it onto your foot, could we, for example, propel another club into the air? The answer is yes. Lay one club across the handle of another so it rests against the knob. Angle your foot and step down firmly to produce the right amount of force. Here are a few quick variations. Two clubs? Here's a great application of this idea with John Spinoza, using a giraffe unicycle to get clubs all the way up to his hands. All right, we can send a club, but can we send a ball? We can add one ball, and with some effort, maybe more. There's probably a lot of other ideas we can come up with using this principle. So if you have any, why don't you post them? That's it for this week on Juggling Laboratories. Remember, try it yourself. Try it yourself?